Hello everybody. Today we're going to talk a little bit more about some uh, parts. And uh, today we're going to talk about armrest pads. Uh, very exciting subject, I know. So I'll keep this short and sweet. Um, the armrest pads in my car had a little wear on them. Uh, they were original. Uh, so I went down into my stash and, and pulled out two that were really nice. A Monte Carlo, though, never had this chrome on the armrest pads, which I like. These are off a Cutlass Supreme. The armrest pads, uh, don't know what they're off of. They're just out of my stash. One of them had the chrome on them, so one would be Oldsmobile. But also, my car had the wrong, um, this thing. The, this is the correct grain for this piece. The ones that were on my blue car out there had a more of a seat pattern on them of which bugged me so i'm still on the lookout for an absolute perfect driver side but i can deal with the uh, hairline crack there for now uh, just because it's uh, kind of out of sight out of mind here's the uh, finished product on the passenger side this piece here is absolutely mint and um, this is an original uh, pad but the base is um, another thing uh, from what I've, I've been told, these bases in the reproduction world do not fit. So take that for what it's worth. Uh, don't throw out your originals. Uh, it's better to have a few scratches. You can always dye them. I just finished dyeing these with a, a good quality uh, Sim dye. And uh, I used this uh, before the uh, dye so it get, gives a real good adhesion and it's only in the 50s in here today it's raining outside and uh, you see the uh, probably didn't even need to be doing this but uh, it turned out great so uh, the spray paint over there on my top plates is having a little harder time drying so I'm gonna have to uh, wait till it warms up on that but uh, I'll talk about top plates later in the next video probably discussing the correct wood grain pattern and why I have bought more wood grain decals for my car. Another thing that you just about cannot find original anymore, you have to buy new decals, but there's a lot of different decals out there. You can also have decals made, um, but you want to get the ones that's correct for the Monte Carlo that'll match the Burlwood dash insert. So that's just a little bit of a heads up for the next video. But um, I'm gonna put these in my car uh, the wife's car actually and uh, see how they look I think they'll look great uh, either way they're staying in there uh, it'll be different you won't see many first gen monies with the chrome on the door pull strap so I mean not the door pull strap but the uh, the armrest base so uh, I'm gonna put them in and uh, may do a little video review on once they're installed and then uh, Follow that up with the uh, top plate discussion. Okay, have a great day.